Love racing Parker over here. This is kind of our normal fun course to run and we're also here in Parker debuting a new turbo. So we're really excited about the T977 getting out here, debuting all of its beauty and glory. Brian McDonald, driver of the T977. We're looking forward to campaigning it here at the Blue Water Desert Challenge, uh, a race we've raced in the past. These guys know this course really well. Fantastic race course because it's got a little bit of everything, but we're definitely going to have a crowded race course tomorrow, which is going to make for a very, very interesting race. Very dusty, but really looking forward to it. With these guys in the car and that car, we have a really, really good chance of winning this race. He's got no excuses. He knows this desert like the back of his hand. Been around here because we have a vacation home out here. I've been around these courses. I really want to have a good finish. I I'm really have no expectations. There's a lot of great drivers in there. I'm starting 25th, kind of in the back. All I want is to keep that car together, get it to the finish. I only have about probably 20 miles of test miles in it. I'm coming from a different platform. So this race is gonna be a learning experience for me. Yeah, I think we have five cars running and we're all running in the same race. Hopefully we don't have to pit. We got uh, my car, we got my dad, we got Derek, uh, the new turbo, and then Mike Delay's over there. Hopefully we could get a couple on the podium. We're in the pro production class, starting near the back, so we're gonna have to make a good charge. We're ready to go. The race so far has been dusty, like the infield was dusty, out there was dusty. Today we've got some wind, so that's going to help some of us starting mid-pack. We're uh, 54 seconds back, so hopefully that'll give us a little bit of advantage to get to the front, but this course is going to be very rough, so we'll see. Derek did really well, I think he ended up second for the first day, and then my dad had some clutch issue. Brian did really good, I think he ended top 10-ish. So today he has a car that's ready to go and see where he ends up. The car is awesome. Uh, it works really well in the rough. We could find a little bit more speed, which we will. Uh, but again, this car only had 30 miles on it. It's a brand new car. So we're super, super happy with how it performed yesterday. I couldn't ask for more. Because the turbo started so far ahead, lap two, they ended up giving us the checkered flag because we got the Grand Prix finish. So we ended up like 10th or 12th or something like that. We were playing around with some clutching and the Allen key spun loose out of my hand and got stuck in my hand. So I had to pull it out and it was a big cut. So we're, we're fine. We're gonna wrap the duct tape for the race.
This season has been a season of bad luck. Blowing motors, popping belts. Uh, two broken axles there. Braden ended up hitting a trophy light stuck in the silt bed. 2020's been like the rest of the world, a little rough. Bad luck all around. So my goal is to not get out of this car the next two days till the finish line.